it always was in the back of my mind to carve stone for many years. So finally when I bought some soapstone and, and started to carve and uh, I, I was hooked. I think they had a first show in, um, in Scottsdale and I just started carving. And uh, I, was, I was a painter and they asked would I um, uh, release some of my carvings for sale. And uh, I said absolutely and I didn't know how much to price them at and they said well don't worry we'll price it for you and we'll see um, what kind of response and uh, I thought wow I, I was really blown away and um, that was my kind of my inspiration to just to keep going. My name is John Sabern. I was born and raised in Fort Simpson and now currently live here in Newland. I carve stone, a uh, variety of stones, soapstones, um, marble, granite, and BC chloride. For me, it's always been, um, I can do, I can do it better. I can do it more, um, more technical. Um, I can work thinner, I can work, um, do it better, I can, I can be more creative, I can make it um, balance, I can make it flow. Um, it's always been a challenge for me just to see how far I can push the stone. Well, normally I just look at the block and uh, sometimes I already have an idea of what I want. And sometimes I'll recreate um, uh, the same image on, but on a different uh, piece of stone. So. I had an image in mind I've done before and I thought well I want to do it a little bit better this time so I wanted to um, create a little bit more movement in there. Talent, it, it didn't come easy for me because it took me years to figure out and to work hard and, and pretty much keep grinding away every day and that's where the bulk of the hard work comes from. 